Hello everyone, we got extra news for today's video. So I just tweeted this out today. XRP will be at $50, but you will sell later seeing it's at four digits. Now, I'm pretty sure XRP will have several pumps before the flip of the switch moment in quotations. I'm guessing it's going to be three pumps. But again, when we do see those pumps, a lot of people will sell later knowing that one day XRP will be at four and five digits. If you go to Val Jester Suite, higher the price equal higher the efficiency. Again, I mean, remember what David Schwartz said about the XRP's price and efficiency. For XRP to be very efficient, guess what it needs to be as well? To be a very, very high price. The question is, when will it take place and what will the price be? Next it comes from Crypto Kevin. XRP new high coming in soon, looking bullish again. I expect that by the time this weekly candle closes, we will be somewhere between $5 and $12. Oh, beautiful guys, look at this. Again, I mean, several pumps. So, this week's candle, we could see $5 to $12. That would be pretty crazy if we did, guys. That would be pretty surreal to see. But again, these numbers, a lot of people think they're crazy, like $10 or 30 40 50 dollars all these crazy numbers but we're going to see these numbers very soon guys if we go to the next year from cryptomaniac this weekly xrp candle should close between five dollars and eighteen dollars again guys i mean this week should be very explosive as we just seen now in last week i predicted that we should be about around six dollars this week we'll see what actually takes place but again but it does look like a few skyrockets are inbound, guys, so be prepared. But remember, a lot of people will sell. Janet Winter can sweet out. Gary Gensler confirmed by Senate today. Guys, look at that. 53 to 45. Beautiful. Now, guys, I mean, we know about Gary Gensler. We do know about Gary Gensler, April 13th. And then today he got confirmed. Because if you go to the next year from Michelle Bond, Gary Gensler has a full agenda as he gets set to take over the SEC. And I believe digital assets will be his legacy. Looking forward to working together to advance crypto policy. Now guys, look how it's all unfolding. Isn't that interesting? Gary Gensler has now come into the play. And again, look at this. The Senate is likely to confirm Gary Gensler as a new SEC chairman, which he did, and crypto assets, including Bitcoin, are highly likely on his agenda. Again, regulations will be coming in. What will, what will happen to all of these other coins when regulations do come in, guys? But XRP is ahead of the gate. Since the SEC already have a case ongoing with Ripple, that means it's going to be the first out of the gate as well. It all, it's all starting to make sense, guys. Next, it comes from Senator Cynthia. If we want to keep pace with China, then we must provide legal clarity to the digital asset industry. Guys, we cannot make these things up. What, what have I been saying? What have I been stating? While the SEC has a reputation as a black hole for invent, in, innovators, Gary Gensler recognizes the potential of digital assets. I mean, innovation, adoption, what have I been saying, guys? The race against China. Again, Chris Larson stated the, the, there's a cold tech war going on about right now. Who's going to win this race, guys? Of course, the U.S. does not want to lose at all. So the U.S. is into the play now. It's going to happen very quick and fast, like we have been stating. SEC News is sweet out. A warm congratulations to Gary Gensler on his Senate confirmation to become chair of the SEC. He will be joining a dedicated staff that works tirelessly day in and day out on behalf of investors and her markets. <laughs> no, this is hilarious on behalf of investors. Remember Jay Clayton, guys. <laughs> but again, Gary Gensler will be good for this whole community, guys. So next it comes from David Morgan. This is a must read. This is the future that the World Economic Forum and global bankers are striving to achieve. So guys, it's pretty simple. Look at that. 
pilot program for the country's central bank digital currency. Now, remember that the central banks will be coming into the play and that's how we know xrp is literally the chosen one guys people need to guys it's so simple it really is so simple but people make it too complicated to see behind the veil because xrp will be the bridge that's why we have been seeing or we've seen so many bridges the bridge of the whole world combining two worlds together guys the bridge between this old financial system and the new financial system Literally the bridge in quotations. Betic XRP has read out everyone for the love of the XRP gods. Watch this video and don't read the transcript. Transcript has inaccuracies. Video is insane. Now basically we can see right here leveraging digital money to facilitate remittances. Also interesting timing with the Gensler nomination. Again, I mean we cannot make these things up guys look at how much news is coming about and left and right literally ha remember there there are no coincidences thank you for joining us here changes that have the potential to reshape cross-border payments and remittances uh, for example last october the bahamas launched the sand dollar the world's first central bank digital currency many other economies are exploring their own pilot programs. Other forms of digital money, such as uh, privately issued stable coins, are increasingly being used for cross-border payments. Cross-border payments. Guys, it's all in front of our faces. It really is. We cannot make these things up. Digital asset investors sweet out the narrative is unfolding. Environment, the environmental friendly, the greener economy, the newer economy. Uh, guys, uh, guys, Apple backs far reaching emissions disclosure rules guys the sec i mean <laughs> well just to see that 138 coinbase open for trading on the nasdaq on wednesday oh 138 huh what do we see here remember it's all about numerology symbologies everything guys again but coinbase is now into the play with the stock i'm pretty sure and then we can see that as well xrp I mean, guys, there are no coincidences. Mr. Yoyo has tweeted out breaking Saudi Arabia's central bank signs blockchain deal with Ripple. Guys, connecting the whole world together. It's not. It's literally not just only about the U.S. It's literally about everyone and everything. Guys, I mean, all the value, all the money. People think I'm crazy, but we will see at the end of the day, guys. We will see. Look at that. Saudi Arabia Central Bank has signed a deal with US-based Ripple to help banks in the kingdom settle payments using blockchain software as golf regulators begin to explore new forms of financial technology. Guys, pilot program. Again, Ripple is literally worked even even Brad Garlinghouse stated Ripple is working with the regulators. That's how they're going to survive, guys. And the regulators, all of these people, they know what XRP is meant to be used for. X Anderson is out. 2021 will be the evolution and birth of CBDCs at scale. 2021, 100% this year, guys. 100% accuracy. So it seems like it's not years away with the CBDCs. Gilbert is working with central banks. Plus, the US will reveal one or two platforms for CBDC in July. It's not years away, guys. They always lie. It's very soon. Literally, a few months from now, maximum. Crypto Granny is out. This is huge. What do we see here? XRP ETP to be listed on Europe's third biggest stock exchange. Again, guys, I mean, look what's happening with XRP. It's being, a, it's having a lot of adoptions and innovations at the same time, being listed everywhere. But again, from five years from now, the elite, the highest class, will own the majority of XRP. Crypto Bloomberg has tweeted out. Bitcoin mining is consuming 66 times more electricity than it did back in late 2015, according to a Citigroup report. Guys, the narratives are literally ongoing. We cannot make these things up, guys. We literally see how they're playing chess. No one is playing checkers, guys. It's all about chess. But a lot seems to be up on the horizon. Who really knows what will take place at the end of the day? But anyways, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys have please leave a like, subscribe, and subscribe. Don't forget to be on my channel. See you guys next time. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. And you guys, see ya.